Yeah. Hey guys, we're um, I'm Uppy here with themusic.com.au. We're here with Dead Letter Circus backstage at the Sydney show. Hey guys, introduce yourselves. Tell us how you are. Hi, my name's Matt Damon. You're lying. <laughs> <laughs> my name's Stuart and I play the bass guitar. And my name is Luke Palmer and I play guitar. Guitar. Amazing. And I'm how are you guys feeling today? I'm feeling super. I'm feeling good. It's kind of cold in Sydney compared to the Gold oh, Coast. Although it's pretty cold up there as well. But it's chilly. Chilly? It is a bit chilly. Uh, we went to have an Antarctic Vortex over the weekend and we didn't really, did Antarctic you guys? Antarctic Vortex. Whoa. What a sick covers band name. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great phrase. <laughs> I don't know who coined it, but... Um... <laughs> So um, you guys are getting ready to do some secret shows next month um, in Brisbane, Sydney and Melbourne around the album re release time as well. Can you tell us any more about what your fans can expect from those? It's a secret. <laughs> um, <laughs> lots of whispering. Uh, you're going to whisper the songs? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I'm not sure, do I look at the camera or do I look you, at you? Uh, it, whatever's comfortable. Weird. All right. I feel like it's, it's so secret that we don't really even know. So we know, I oh, we know what we're going to be doing, but um, we actually still don't know where the venues are. Mm. Um, we haven't found out that yet. There's a lot of things we haven't found out about it yet. But we will be playing acoustically a lot of the um, new material, which will be very intimate, and mm -hmm. that'll be a, quite a small venue. I think it's limited to fifty, uh, yeah, 50 tickets. tickets yeah. Each venue. Each venue, yeah. yeah. Very and small. And there'll be a bit of uh, meet and greet cool. going on, and some signings and. That yeah. kind of thing. Yeah, kiss some babies. Kiss some babies. That sounds weird. Please explain. <laughs> yeah, kiss some babies. Like a politician. Like a politician. Oh, okay. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> um, now you're planning little USB sticks around the venue. I saw you guys doing that earlier. Yes. Um, to give fans. Well, you did it initially to give fans a taste of in plain sight. Mm. Um, I was going to ask, will you be doing any more of these little things? But obviously you are. So what is this for? If you can tell us that. It's just a little, little bit of fun. It's just an Easter egg hunt. Mm. Four USB keys, each venue. A little snippet. So it's a different <laughs> snippet, isn't it, on each? Yeah, every USB yeah. stick has a very unique snippet of In Plain Sight, which is, I know it's been, it, it was played on the radio yeah. and Triple J for the first time last night. Yeah. And, um, but you still can't buy the song, is that correct? Let's say yes. Let's say yes. Yeah. Uh, and so that, that um, little piece is kind of cool. Yeah. Check out a bit of the how, how cool it sounds. How, yeah. how, how long is the little clip? Oh, it's like 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Yeah, I think. Really a taste seconds. up. Yeah. So you need to like find everyone else who's found these USB keys and compile it. I think you could compile yeah. it if they all communicate mm. with each other. Yeah, you could yeah. compile yeah. the whole song. We need Maybe. to set up some kind of home base <laughs> people upload to. It's like you're yeah. making, forcing people to make friends. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Forcing, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, make friends. And so it's nearly time to release Aesthesis. Aesthesis? Aesthesis. Aesthesis. Yes. Makes me feel like I have a lisp. Yeah, that's it. Um, and that's next month. And I'm sure a lot of people have been hearing while you wait from it already. Mm. Um, what inspiration did you have for that video clip? Wow. That was all Luke Palmer, that one. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That was, uh, that was Kimberly Menti's hard work there. Yeah. Um, mainstream media, yeah. problem, reaction, solution. There was, um, there was uh, the original concept was to, to base the clip on the, the lyrical content of that song and um, it was quite, it is quite an intense lyric if, if, you, um, if you kind of paid attention to the, to, the, to the lyric content in that, in that song and so the clip ended up becoming really intense, maybe slightly more than what we thought it needed to be and so then we ended up just broadening the scope of it a little bit mm -hmm. And um, the director and um, the artists involved were amazing, and and it, it was still based on the on the. Hey, we had two of our good friends. Hey, 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 hey. hey guys. Hey. 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 This is Paul from I'm Giant. This is Paul. Hello. Hey, nice to meet you. How are you? Nice to meet you. 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 Nice to meet Oh, you're honestly. I'm trying to take us to New Zealand in a couple of weeks' time. Yeah. <laughs> Quite Australian, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody um, Kiwis born in the tent as well. <laughs> hey, I'm, I've, only got, I've only got two hands. Most Kiwis here three. <laughs> One to hold the sheep. Backstage, everyone. <laughs> yes. Um, and some quick, quick fire questions just before we go. Um, what's your worst tour experience or injury? 
Worst. Mm. I reckon you'd have more than me. Um, yeah, I did have my toenail ripped off once. <laughs> by, by a base head in a case was rolled. It was like the la very last show uh, of an American tour, so it didn't matter too much. So I had, had a few, few angles. Yeah. But it ripped it right back, folded it right back, and I had to, I had to fold it back. <laughs> it did that little, you know how when you fold Does something it back on it, kinked, yeah. Oh, yeah, nice. So I had to like kink it back. Oh. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, I, um, I don't think I've ever had a tour injury. Oh, wow. You're too safe. You don't make it happen. That same night, Kim jumped off a speaker stack onto the stage and messed his foot up as well. Oh. It was brilliant. It's a months. good night. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> good night all around. Thank you, Jameson. Can you guys do a celeb impression? Oh, no. Um, oh, my God. Surely, Chris the Walken would be, but I can't do it. Do it. No, I can't. Yeah, you can. No, well, I really can't. Uh, who else? Just um, to interrupt, someone's asking how long your toenail was. How long was it? <laughs> it was a talon. It was a rapid yeah. Was it as long as your uh, little... It, no, it, was, it wasn't very long. It was long enough to catch and like, fold back. Oh. Yeah, back to celeb yeah. impressions, because that's gross. <laughs> <laughs> Any requests? Yeah, let's go. Let's go to the go to really the fast. Go, go, go. As in you guys. Requests. Okay, no one's given any. Moving on. Um, <laughs> Sorry, I've got. I've what's got no, the no? It's cool. No skills. Um, what's a guilty pleasure song you both love? Uh, the new Justin Bieber song. The the Where Are You Now? Yeah, Where Are You Now? Yeah. I don't know. It's guilty pleasure. That's really, really? Sick, eh? okay. It's really good book. Yeah. Are we, Diplo? Can we still be in the band together? <laughs> <laughs> You don't have to look at me, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I do like uh, Uptown Funk, speaking of... Uh, that's a sick song. Yeah. yeah that's, a awesome. song. that's not a guilty it's pleasure. It's not really a guilty pleasure. Hey, we should soundtrack that song tonight. Yeah, I know, you know, that's, I know, I know. Yeah. That'd be it. sick, do it, yeah. do it. Um, and lastly, what are you afraid of? This doesn't have to be really deep, but... Um, do you have any phobias? What am I afraid of? I actually have a real problem with heights. Oh, yeah? I never used to. But now I do. It's like I've developed an irrational The older you get, yeah. the more careful you get. I did one of those high wire tree climbing things <laughs> and I got to the red level and I actually freaked out a bit. Yeah, right. I couldn't do it. Did you have but to? I'm going to go back and defeat that. Yeah, yeah. yeah go do it. Yeah. I am, I am, I am, I have a fear of vomiting. Really? Yeah, I, I did. I did a, um, my, my latest, my longest stint was actually. <laughs> I think 13 years, <laughs> and that was only till recently as well. And uh, Kim Benzie was lucky enough to witness the uh, the breaking of that 13 years. Pull your hair back. Yeah, yeah. I, was, I was in the studio and I was um, just started feeling really weird, and then I got sick from something and I was throwing up in the garden outside the front of Louis Stone Studios. Oh, I did hear about that. And uh, I think it's actually Clint Goff, who's the artist that painted the, uh, the film well, clip. Know. He walked past and he just heard me rustling and vomiting <laughs> in the garden. So you're alright, man. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> true story. True story. And now your yeah. counter's restarted. Yeah. Um, I'm not. I'm not so afraid of it anymore. Oh. That's the good side. Fair That's enough. Fine. No one likes bombing, though. <laughs> no. Anyway, thanks so much for stopping by, guys. Um, good luck with your show in a little while. Yeah. yeah. Um, and hopefully some people watching will stop by. Are yeah. actually out there watching. That'd be cool. Yeah, Periscope. Hey, we're going to do the Periscope soon too, so... Yeah, watch out for, for Dead Letter Circus's yeah. Periscope. Hey, bye guys. Bye! bye.